Snacks though. If I give him a snack, he'll eat that book like his regular food. He pretty much waits like okay. the whole day before he gets to it and he doesn't eat it all. Mm -hmm. What food is he on? Uh, pedigree. Hey, how's it going? Hi. I'm Dr. Hanson. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. How are you doing? So he's got a little wrap on his leg where he took some blood for his heartworm test and he kind of wiggled in his vein. Kind of blew a little bit, so we're just going to keep that wrap. We'll do the easy one first. How about, how about, oh, that's the wrong one. There you go. <laughs> there you go. One, two, three. Yummy. Easy. Yummy job. They never like that one. I don't know why <laughs> it's not flavored better. You would think it would be nice. Okay, here you go, buddy. Let me start with the left side. Thank you, thank you. Okay, my man. Go up here so he doesn't move that little leg. There you go, Bubba. Ready, one, two, three, book. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's a good book. Oh, I know, I know. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. You did so good. One more, <laughs> one more. <laughs> He's really doing good. Come around. Alright, this one's going in the right hind. Alright, my dude. It's gonna be quick and easy. Quick and easy. Okay, okay. Good boy. 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 <laughs>
dolls and dolls. Welcome back to another video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I am currently in the car running errands. As you can see, I went to Dollar Tree. That was my first stop. Let's check the to-do list because I do have a few places I need to go to today. So, so far, I went to take Jasper to his doctor's appointment. And I don't know what they did with his arm. His um, They was drawing some blood and they, I don't know, poked him some kind of way. And now his little um, arm is bleeding. But they put a, a thing around it to stop it from bleeding. They said if it don't, then I need to bring him back in. Oh, it better stop. It better. It better stop because I don't know what y'all did. Um because that's never happened before so what y'all do to make it bleed more than and then they said it bled more than it normally you know normally supposed to so what did y'all do wrong what did y'all do different but we shall see prayers going up but he is like eight pounds i think almost nine pounds but yeah and if everything else is good he has some blood drawn for his heart test why they trying to get me to get my dog neutered they keep talking about that i'm not getting my freaking dog neutered i want him to have some puppies i want him to mate with somebody and get some puppies so i can get this money <laughs> no but for real i want him to mate with somebody i don't want to get him neutered like they've been talking about getting him neutered ever since i had him at one point i was going to get his tail cut which i don't understand why the person that I got the dog from why wouldn't they go ahead and cut the damn tail off cut the freaking tail off like you supposed to do that when they're like little bitty baby like first born I thought like why would you not do that so I was thinking about it um you know getting it cut off because it really looked so weird when he was a little bitty really small dog like a baby it really looked so weird. It looked like a rat tail to me. I did not like it. So, I was going to get it done. And it was like it was almost, like, I think it was like seven something, 700 and something, 800 and something. That's with the anesthesia, like the aftercare and all of that stuff. But they say he had to be a certain age in order to get it because, you know, he's a small dog or whatever. So, he had to be like, I think, six months or something like that. So, when six months came and they was like 700 800 i was just thinking like and then they had they got to put him on them you put him under and 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 then they was talking about neuter neutering him she was like yeah i'll neuter him like i'll do it all at the same time and i'm like i didn't ask i don't want him to, i don't want this so why you keep saying something about that so that was the first time they were trying to say something about it like when i wanted to get that procedure done so but I just thought about it. I was just like, as he got older, the tail really, you know, didn't look bad to me. Like, it don't really look bad to me. And I'm like, I don't even want to put him through that, like, going under and all that kind of stuff. And just going through the aftercare or whatever. I'm just like, it don't look bad, so I'm not even fit to worry about it. I'm not fit I don't even want to pay $800 just to get his tail cut off anyways. Like... And like I said, it doesn't look bad now that he's older. I kind of like it. it. Really was on my nerves when he was a little bit of baby because it looks it looked like a worm or a rat tail. But now that he's older, like I said, it doesn't bother me, so I'm not even gonna worry about it. So today when I went in, I hope y'all follow me. You follow me? You follow me? So today when I went in, they said something about um you can get this little uh, microchip inside your puppy your dog or whatever just in case somebody try to you know try to pull up on you snatch your dog or steal your dog or whatever you'll be able to track where your dog is and the way it is in this world like i would get that but it's only like 50 dollars. but you have to pay for the anesthesia of course and i don't know how much it is which i don't really care about that um I was just tripping out the fact they threw in this same thing about the freaking neutering. Um, she was like, if you don't um, want to put him like under, they'll give him small doses or whatever to 
make it not hurt so bad because she was like the needle is kind of pretty thick to put the like they it's like a needle and the device is inside the needle and they, they inject it inside of them through the needle and she said it's kind of thick so it may hurt since I'm not gonna go with the neuter neutering whatever situation she was like she she can give him like a small dose that he can't he won't be able to feel it I was like okay now you talking we'll go with that option but I'm gonna wait on that I'm gonna think more on it look, you know read up on it because I don't really know too much about it I just know you can be able to track your dog down with somebody steal it so I was kind of sold with that part but I still want to look into it or whatever and see if that's something I even really really need to do or want to do but yeah so that's that and he got all his shots he go back in six months to get some other kind of shots and he got this um little he got this chewy thing that he takes it's like medicine i guess he takes it every, once a month it's called a heart guard it's for like heartworms and stuff like that and then it's something called something for like fleas and ticks that he's supposed to take um that's once a month too shall these doctor bills um pet bills be more expensive than it than people bills but it's once a year or every six months or something like that anyway so that's that so we did that and then um i'm sitting in the car waiting on my son he's getting his hair cut so we're doing that, waiting on him. And then once he get out, we are going to Costco's to pick up my rice that I love so much that Costco's has. I get this lo mein mixed with vegetables that they have. And I get some uh, fried rice with vegetables in it that they have. I'm going to take you along with me. But yeah, we're going to get that because we're going to eat some of that during this week coming up and then i'm going to get some of their chicken when i show y'all this chicken make sure you go get you some because that is the best frozen chicken wings it's like already made and stuff you can just put it in the air fryer and it has like this buffalo sauce you can use the buffalo sauce if you want or you can eat it plain of course my son likes his plain i like my buffalo sauce on mine um but yes those are like the best frozen wings like if you want to have like a party or something like that and you know you want some quick wing quick wings to cook or whatever that's already you know pretty much seasoned and everything throw them in the air fry those are the best ones to get they are so good so freaking good they are small tiny but they are so good i think it's like a i forget how how many pounds but I'm going to get some of that. I'm going to get the rice and lo mein. And that's it. That's all I'm going to get from Costco's. And then I need to go by Best Buy. I might go by Best Buy before I go to Costco's. If they have one around here. I want to check out um, their iPads. I need to get my iPad so I can start loading my videos faster than what I'm doing. Because I have a lot of footage that I need to edit and post. But I need an iPad not gonna show i'm not gonna tell y'all what i've been anyways but anyways yeah i need to check on the ipad and i want to get these little glasses that you can record because i be catching a lot of stuff and i don't have my camera out all the time so i want to get these sunglasses they ray-ban sunglasses and you can record like while you're out just have your glasses on and you just record and while you're walking and don't nobody know hey it's so cool but yeah i'm gonna look into getting some of those too and then we got to go to walmart and pick up our um grocery pickup yay how fun is that but yeah we got to do that pick up our groceries and i really just get like stuff for the week i shop every week like i don't shop i shop like every week once a week i get everything that i know we're going to eat that week because i used to get I used to go overboard. I would just buy stuff, buy stuff, buy stuff. And the stuff would go old. So it'll go bad and I'd be throwing away. So I'm not doing it no more. I'm just going to do about a week. Whatever we're going to eat that week, I get that. Then the next week, I get what we need. That, just like that. And let's talk about how groceries are so expensive. I wish I had some food stamps, honestly. Big up to y'all who getting those food stamps out there. That's a blessing. <laughs> because I hate paying for groceries. Like... 
they're so expensive i'm sick and tired of paying for groceries every freaking week every week groceries 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 but um i might get us some i might get me some chipotle to eat for today because the groceries and stuff that i'm getting i'm not we're not eating it um i don't want that today we're eating it tomorrow and the rest of the week I might get me some Chipotle and I might take you all along. I know I said the last time I was going to take you all along with me so y'all can see how I be ordering my foods. But I forget. And then I was kind of a little nervous because there was too many people in there watching this stuff. I don't be wanting to have my camera out. They be thinking like, oh, you recording me? No, you are not famous. You are not spectacular enough for me to be recording you. But anyways, and I'm going to get my son some McDonald's. He does not like Chipotle. And he would eat like five burgers, y'all. Cheeseburgers. Plain. Just a meat and cheese. And he would eat three. Um, or he would get like three McDoubles. Just a meat and cheese. And he likes to change his, ses his, change his bun to a sesame seed bun. Not the regular bun, but the sesame seed bun. But he's a burger eater. He loves burgers. Okay, so let me do this um, Dollar Tree thing. Dollar Tree house. So, anyway, so I found this little cute little um, treat jar or something that I can use for. It say, it says yummy. It's a little dog treat container. Um, for my puppy at Dollar Tree. I thought this was cute. I was gonna get another one, but I don't know. I should have got the other one too. They only had two left. This one and another one. I should have got it. So I'm gonna fill his um fill this up with his treats. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go back and get some more. Cause I don't wanna mix his treats. Like he got different treats that he eats. I don't wanna just mix them all in one thing. But I might have to do that for now. Then I just got some stuff to clean up with. I love using this to scrub out the toilet. If you can see it. I use that to clean out the toilet. Then I got these little things to put in my closets. Make the closet smell good. These little jelly like adjustable solid gel. Scented gel things. I don't know. But yeah, I got these to put in the closet. Make it clothes smell good. It really works. You have your closet smelling so good. And it's at Dollar Tree. Why not get it? And I just got this little cheap little tray or pan or whatever from when I'm making like my cornbread and stuff. I needed one badly. That's all I use it for is for cornbread. And what else did I get? I got one of these little things. I pretty much, um, you know, the little thing, the little um, freshener that goes on the wall. They just it sprays out every so often. It's a timer on it. You can set it. This is the refill. I'm not sure if this one fits in the one that I have. So I bought one just to see if it does. Linen. It's the linen kind. The fresh. That's the kind that I. My battery went dead. That's why I was kind of trying to talk fast because I knew it was going to die soon. But anyway, so I get this little linen. I get this, but I this well I don't get this. This is the first time I've got this kind from um, Dollar Tree. I saw these, but I use like the refills that's on the wall, the the spray thing that's on the wall. You just put like refills in it. Um, but when I did my grocery pickup, they didn't have any of the linen spray. I like fresh scents and stuff like that, so they didn't have any. So I was I saw this in Dollar Tree. I'm like, let me try this, but I don't know if it fits. I don't know if this is the right size, so I just got one to see. So we're gonna see how that is. Hopefully it fits because that's actually cheaper, of course, than the ones that I get at Walmart. So if it works and it smells really good, you know, which I know it is because it's linen. I love linen. Fresh scent. But yeah, that's all for the um, I think that's all. Yeah, that's all for the um Dollar Tree haul. I'm gonna take y'all to Costco's when I get there. I'm about to take him out 
to see if he need to use the restroom because when I go to Costco, he's going to have to stay in the car because they don't allow animals. Um, Dollar Tree said they didn't allow animals either. I saw that sign and guess what? I walked right on in there with my baby. This is my baby. This is not an animal. <laughs> I treat him just like my real baby. Like, don't play with him. Don't play with him. He going in too. Forget what y'all talking about. But yeah, let's get into this hair. Y'all see my curls done fell. I'm ready for my braids. This is the thing that I don't like about having my sew wings and quick weaves. Like when you out, your hair just be blowing and stuff and it just be all over. You get out the car, poof, the wind blowing your hair and stuff. Then you walk into the building, your hair all over your head. You got to go straight to the restroom. Braids, you don't have that part. So I'm ready for my braids. Summertime, I'm going to have my braids back in my head. But for my birthday, I'm going to have a sew in and it's gonna be super duper long bust down the middle but yeah let me take him out for a walk and then um i'll get back with y'all when i get to costco's toodles
This ramen is really good. It's good? Because you got to get your udon. We do, but it's in the frozen, or not the frozen, it's in the packaged aisle. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Channel it cool. All in the way. Costco's, y'all. Yeah. Remind you, I've been in there several times, like recording and stuff like this. Um, and this lady at the little checkout thing, this lady at the checkout, um, the self checkout. Usually, I scan my own stuff. I don't have nobody there to scan my stuff, but it was a worker there. When I walked up, she was just looking, just looking at me when I had my camera, and I was about to put my camera down so I can scan my stuff. And I was like, because she was looking at me, I was like, um, I said, are you scanning? And she was like, yeah, we're scanning and um, it's no recording. And I was like, um, I said, oh, it's no recording. And she was like, um, <laughs> no, I'm talking about this lady. I was in the store. I was in the store at self-checkout. Remind you, I've recorded before when I have um, came to this store. I was, I record or something. And I went to self-checkout and they had like the little workers there. I guess they was there to help out and scan or something like this. So when I walked up, the lady, she was just looking with like a little smirk on her face or whatever and I was about to put my camera down and she was like uh she was like oh it's no recording I was like are you scanning scanning she was like yeah we're scanning it's no recording or whatever and I was like oh I said I didn't know that I couldn't uh record I walked through the door you know when you walk the door they ask you for your card I had my camera in my hand didn't nobody say nothing about me recording or nothing but she said something I said oh I didn't know uh it was an issue about recording she was like yeah uh, yeah, you uh, can't record or whatever and um, you know, it's rules everywhere or something something like this She said I said well, they need to put a sign outside or something because it uh, this is not my first time recording I always record and no one is, has ever said anything about recording And then she was like, uh, you can you can go ahead and um, if you're done done scanning girl You the one supposed to push you set trying to tell me to push push the button to uh, if I'm done scanning You the one who scanned my stuff. Why you didn't push done? I said oh, I hear it like she's trying to get an attitude with some girl if you don't go on workers everywhere the people in front everything and no one said anything about me recording girl you just mad <laughs> you just mad because i look cute and stuff and i'm trying to get my money on youtube people be trying to do too much i would have never even said nothing i'm here to scan your stuff ma'am and go on about my business you can record all you want to what you would have did if that lady would say something to you <laughs> what did you look at? Yeah, there's rules everywhere. Like I'm trying to disobey what she's saying or whatever. Girl, I'm I'm okay. I respect that if y'all say we can't record, but girl, you ain't got to drag it now. Be quiet. I'm putting I'm cutting it off. It's like you trying to drag it now. That's where it becomes the issue. You trying to drag it. Okay, we about to go do grocery pickup and then yeah 
She done irritated me. <laughs> now, what you want for McDonald's? <laughs> Two double cheeseburgers, a large fry, and then a regular cheeseburger. Two double cheeseburgers, a large fry, and a regular cheeseburger. Yeah. Is that fine? <laughs> You would have tried to get two two double cheeseburgers. I mean, I, three a, double cheeseburgers. Yeah, I would, but you said no nah, last time. You gonna get that's you gonna be filled up with it. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> this one I eat. Three double cheeseburgers, a large fry. Not a small fry, but a large. We're at Mickey D's in case you all didn't know. Let's place this order so we can get on. Come on now. Oh, no, we're going to be done using the mobile app? No. Order whenever you're ready. Um, yes, can I have three double cheeseburgers with just the meat and cheese? Three double cheeseburgers, plain? Yes, plain. Three double cheeseburgers. Two or three? Three. I'm sorry, three. That's fine. Three plain double cheeseburgers, will I be all? And can I have a large fry? A large french fry? Yes. Okay. And also, can you put those on sesame seed buns instead of the regular buns? A sesame seed bun? Yes. Okay. And that's all. All right, it'll be the next one now. Your mouth part with water for the burgers. <laughs> Three double cheeseburgers, a large fry on the sesame seed bun, meat and cheese only. Oh, this song, Jazz. Maybe you have a, um, what's it called? It's them pub cups. I know that's not a thing here, but I'm talking yeah, about Yeah, it like, is a thing. Uh, no, I'm Which, not talking about this restaurant. Like, I don't think they do they have that at McDonald's. Oh, you talking about McDonald's? Yeah. No, I I don't know. I think they just do Starbucks. that at Starbucks, but I don't know. That's that's like whipped cream, right? Too old. I thought I it was ice cream. No, I think it's like whipped cream or <clears> something. <throat> I think that's probably too sweet or something for a, a book and a dog. But people be doing. I ain't, so I you be trying to get his sugar up with that uh, syrup thing. Yeah, but it's like a little teaspoon when I do that, just in case it's sugar low. They poop cook. I don't know about this. I have to call his doctor next. <laughs> yeah. X's doctor can. Can Jasper have a poop cook? <laughs> what? You're just looking at me. We have one more stop to make, guys, and this is a wrap. I'm so freaking ready to get to the house. I have made <clears> about <throat> a million stops. Hello. Hi. It's gonna be 1370 for three double cheese. And that's on the sesame seed bun, right? I'm sorry? It's on the sesame seed bun? Yes, it's on there. And it's a large fry? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's what she did. Mm-hmm. Yes, on the sesame seed bun. Yeah, make sure I say that because y'all uh, give me a regular thing. Thank you. Here, take the food. Here is food. I always check your receipts, guys. Check yeah, your receipts. That's right. Because they overcharge people. Yeah, let me get this camera down for a while. Next stop, the last stop.
after a long day of errands. Gonna do a quick little grocery haul with y'all. And then guess what? I'm eating and chilling out. So I got some of these. I'm showing you all this first because I need to be able to put these in the fridge. So I got these. So good. I've been hooked on these for a couple of weeks. And the funny thing about it, I don't really like the strawberry part. I eat around that part. I'll eat a little bit of the strawberry part, but I mostly like the vanilla part of it, the white part of it. But yeah, these right here. And then we have these. Ace been hooked on these for a while, well, a couple of weeks or months now. He'll probably change up. He'll probably change up soon. And then we have this. This is just something for me to eat for a little snack for lunch or something. Pie pie. They are right. you just some to put in your stomach. And then we have the Stouffords. <laughs> this is the mac and cheese and Salisbury steak. This is what um, my son is going to eat when he get out of school. Some little afternoon snacks. Then we have the mac and cheese. The Velveeta, that's the best kind. I used to eat the other kind of crab kind, I think, a long time ago. When I started eating this, couldn't go back. Then I got these little quick little sides to make. I think I got some more. This one. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. This one. Got those. Got two boxes of the French toast sticks. We've been kind of hooked on these for a couple of weeks too. So I'm easy to pop in the oven. Got this. But my son to eat for a quick little snack after school. I've been tricking him with these. <laughs> the off brand kind. I don't know if he can tell the difference, but. Then we got some popcorn, kettle corn. It's the best kind. We got some little Kleenexes for my son to take to school. He has allergies. His nose been running really, really a lot. Got a little toothpaste, two toothbrush holder for my son's toothbrush. Back brush for my son. He need to wash that back. Get that dirt up off there. We got some chicken seasoning. This seasoning is so good. And we got this famous chicken from Costco. This is the chicken that I was talking about. It tastes so good. You can use the sauce or you can eat it plain. So, so good. Already seasoned, popping in the um, air fryer. Boom, there you go. Quick little meal. I'm all about quick meals. Quick meal. Chicken fried rice. We got two boxes of these. Tomato for my salad. Although I forgot to get some salad. Mix. And we got the lo mein noodles mixed with the vegetables. Yummy yum. We got some eggs. We have some bread. <laughs> and we have some orange juice. So my son can get him some vitamin C. What is it? Vitamin C? Yeah. And we have some cream cheese for my bagels and milk. I don't know what happened. Should I drink this milk? Because it was wasting out. Like, I don't know if it's open. Somehow that lid is like, I don't know, it's leaking. I don't know if I should drink it or not. Which I don't drink milk anyway. I use this for like pancakes and stuff. I don't know, I might not drink the milk since it was open. But yeah, that's it for the grocery haul. I'm about to put this groceries up and get in the shower, eat my food. I got my Chipotle, y'all. Mm -hmm. 
And I'm still thinking about this lady at this freaking Costco telling me I can't record, which that's not the issue. The issue is you're going to try to say I can't record when I don't pass. I done made it up to the point to check out with my camera recording and nobody stopped me. Even the person that told me to come to check out didn't say anything to me and I had the camera up and he was checking my car. Did not say nothing. But you, big y'all, look head. <laughs> Gonna try to say something about my freaking camera. But anyways, we're gonna put these groceries up. I'll holler at y'all. This is the end of this video. Hope you like it. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Toodles.